planetary problem. I have noticed a propensity of many to look at problems in terms of this country, whatever the country might be. It seems that most have the idea that there is a governmental solution to psychopaths who are politicians in their country. Solutions range from testing politicians for psychopathy to passing laws that require some behaviors to be outlawed. I want to bring the picture to the larger frame. First, let's start with the knowledge that fewer than 100 people own well over half the wealth on our planet. In fact, it is fast approaching 70%. Now, as I am wont to do, let us suppose. Suppose you are one of the less than 100 people. You control an enormous amount of wealth. You can buy anything and anyone you choose to. You have enough to feed, clothe, house, offer good medicine, and otherwise provide for all of humanity on our planet. Would you choose to end poverty? end suffering and starvation, make the world better for everyone. Now, suppose you are a psychopath with no caring, compassion, love or empathy for anyone but yourself. Suppose that you feel no remorse if you should cause problems for others. Suppose that you thrill to having power over others, enjoy toying with them, causing them anguish, even sacrificing them. Would you hoard the wealth, enjoying the widespread misery we see around the globe? Would you revel in it? Suppose that, Having all this wealth, you got together with the others who have what you have, and that they are psychopaths too. Would you propose or agree with a proposal to control humanity 100%? Would you set about to buy all the major corporations on the planet? to own the governments, which are all incorporated? Would you seek to own the media, the education, the publishing, the entertainment, the legal system, the militaries, the police, the medical industry, the pharmaceutical industry, research, technology, food production, water processing, the web, social media, software, communications, banking, religions, the land, the water, the air humanity breathes. Would you, owning all this, then toy with humanity? hiding and suppressing information you don't want them to have? Would you censor and defame and shut down any people and ideas that do not conform to your goals? Would you indoctrinate, alter history, propagandize, lie, bribe, set up blackmail scenarios, threaten, ruin, and kill anyone who is a threat, make up news to push agendas, create divides so that people fight one another and not you, 
create problems that are not real? Tell the people what their reaction is. Push through a solution that fits your agenda. Mandate toxins be jabbed into everyone based on hyping fake and natural diseases? To injure most, reduce their lives, sicken them to your profit. Strip the people of protection, both physically and legally? Would you buy the officers in your corporations, giving them scripts to act out, especially ones whose roles are as world leaders? Of course, they also would include the politicians you appoint to office. Would you buy people to spread false data on the web? Prop your play? Control the opposition? Troll dissenters? Would you deliberately degrade the medicine, land, food, water, air, and electromagnetic environment? Would you spray debilitating things on the food and in the air? Would you add things like sodium fluoride, a toxic waste, to the water? Would you promote jobs that served only to move wealth upwards to you in the final scheme of things? Would you do any unethical thing to manipulate and control the people of the planet? Would you declare all humanity incompetent, seizing their shares of the planet and holding it all in trust? See my video, Trusts. In all this supposition, the state we are in right now emerges. We have psychopaths in control. What is the key thing that allows this? Why, money, of course. No amount of effort to test for psychopathy will get it done. No laws will be passed that hinder them the psychopaths in control. They choose what laws are passed. Oh sure, they give a little to preserve the illusion we have any say. But it's always small stuff. Behind the game, the agenda marches on. Hope and change! Drain the swamp! <laughs> Not! The one thing we have, they need our consent. And if we withdraw it, withhold it, consent to better, we can co-create something that will not promote psychopaths to power. We can get free energy out in the open and take money down. We can claim our sovereignty on our planet within ethics. See my playlist for details on what we can build for humanity. For you, for me, for all others. Amaterasu Solar, Shill for Humanity. Love always. Humanity will win.